All right, yo, it's your boy Randy Jackson. I'm sitting here, man. Cambio first right here with a great Josh J. Josh, what's up, man? How you doing? So listen, those of you that don't know, but you will know very soon, Josh is probably the greatest young magician that I've Thanks. ever seen. I'm telling you, this guy is like ridiculous. When I met him, like it's almost like a year ago, I was turned on to him by my boy James Diener and I was like, I couldn't believe, dude, how talented this guy was. Was sitting at a restaurant. Yeah. It was four of us on a tabletop. By the time we left, everybody from the restaurant was over there because he was just so unbelievably cool. You've seen close-up magic, but you've never seen close-up magic like this. Josh, look, man, so tell me, has close-up magic always been what you were into? Did you, yeah. when you grew up as from, a kid? From the beginning. I, my passion is using my surroundings and using people, interacting with people. On a big stage, you can't reach people the same way you can reach them if you're right here. You won, like, the World Championship of Magic. you got to show everybody that's watching. I noticed something that you did that just tipped it over the edge. What helped you win? What trick helped you win that? This is the trick that I designed uh, with sleight of hand, and it's just a normal pack of cards, and you can do it anytime, anywhere, and it's got some of the most difficult moves I've ever worked on it. So I wanted to turn you guys on to what I think is cool next, what is hot happening right now. Josh is definitely happening, man. Go check him out. Do you consider yourself more the kind of person who wants to figure out how the tricks are done, or just enjoy and relish in the moment? Enjoy and relish in the moment. Really? Mm-hmm. All right. And have you seen a lot of sleight of hand before? Um, yeah. Yeah? All right, so so you're a fan <laughs> of the sleight of hand and the close-up stuff, yeah? Uh -huh. All right, so say stop. Stop. And I want you to get a card that you want. So you want to go a little more, or do you like that spot? That's good. Okay. Write your initials so that they can see it really big at home. I'll hold it for you. Write your initials across that card. That way you know there's only one, two of the club, two of clubs in the world with. Is that T-Y? Yes. Y. T-Y. So here's the deal. Rather than hand you the card, because people think you can somehow get it out of your hand, I'm going to have you bite down on this card. <laughs> bite down. That is perfect. <laughs> do not move. <laughs> I'll do the same thing you do. A different card. Mine's the nine of hearts. And hold out both hands for me. That's good. And here's what we'll do. You look at me, forget about the camera, forget about all the people watching, <laughs> just watch me. <laughs> Hold still, because now I've got the card. And if I've got your card here, <laughs> take a look. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay. Now I wonder how you did it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Can't change your mind. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. We're actually married now in several Yay. cultures because of that. Oh my gosh. My new bride. That's awesome. <laughs>